Hey, what is going on, everybody? How are you all doing today? I hope you all are having a wonderful and fantastic day today, and if not, hopefully you all will have a better tomorrow. So today I wanted us to discuss world building and how too much of it in Ruby can actually be a problem. And I really feel like as of late, this has actually become a bit more of a problem than it ever has been realistically. So sit back, relax, I hope you all enjoy, and let's go ahead and jump right on into this discussion. So when we look at world building, it's not a bad thing to do per se for a series, but one of the best times to actually do world building is at the beginning of the series. And one problem with Ruby now is it has been having world building just used way too much. I feel like it is abusing world building at this point, but I'll get into that in a moment. But when you look at world building, it establishes the world itself. It establishes even the history of the series. It does a lot of things for the world of the series itself. And, you know, it's not bad to add things to the world building, but when you add too much or abuse the system of world building too much, it becomes flooded. And then so many more questions rise from you know, the answers that are being thrown out there at the time being. And this can become a problem because this floods the story. This has so much that you have to answer at that point. And if you leave any of it behind or if it gets forgotten, then there becomes plot holes because they could actually be very important to the future of the series. And looking at where Ruby is now, the problem, or at least one big problem of the series is the relics have really clogged the story essentially because yes, we know that they're relics. Yes, they hold a big part and a big key to the plot. But the problem is now is that they are so focused upon that when you actually think about it, it's like that's the main focus at this point is this as well as world building. And of course, you know, looking at the maidens, maidens became a big part of the plot, but it didn't take away from it. It didn't just flood in on the plot and then that was the whole thing that it was entirely about. It actually was a good part, but it's not like it was too consuming, which was a good thing because it feels like as opposed to the maidens, the relics clog the plot or they put so much big emphasis that it just takes up so much and they raise more questions and that doesn't really help the plot at all and the one thing that was good about the plot in the past was it was character driven it was based off the fights and yes it still kept with the plot so it's not like it cut out things that wasn't important but you know it really made the series feel better it made the series feel more fluid because when you saw these character interactions and you saw it being driven by character, it was very interesting to see these characters, their interactions, their personalities, you know, how they react to certain situations, as well as watching these fight scenes. These fight scenes have been beautiful in the first three volumes, and they looked very nice, they were very fluid, and, you know, it was very good to actually see all this go in, and it all made sense. It's not like it clogged the plot, it's not like it clogged the series itself, because that was what it was actually supposed to be based upon was its characters and of course its fighting and you know the plot's an important thing but you know when you clog it too much it becomes a problem and world building has really just built up too much if that makes sense i mean yeah it's good to world build as i said but when you abuse it when you put too much in there you just do too much to the series that's not a good thing it brings more negatives than it does positives and things can be forgotten and you know, that's the thing, is that it feels like the characters have really been kind of more pushed aside than anything else, and the fights have really been dubbed down in comparison to what they were, and it just feels like the world building has overtaken the characters and the fights now, and that's actually not a good thing for the series, considering that the series was based upon its characters and were based upon the fighting, and to really just kind of cut them out or make them feel one-dimensional, and that's been the problem with the characters within the past two volumes. Some characters have been treated decently, and some characters have been treated very badly. And, you know, the thing is, character development is a very important thing to any series. And when you just start to diminish the characters, or make them forget things they used to be able to do, or even cut down their characters to where they just believe in one thing and they're one-dimensional, and once you scratch away that one thing they believe in, there's nothing there, it becomes a problem. And, you know, whenever it was character-driven, this was not a problem at all whatsoever, because looking at each character, each character felt like they had something you could relate to. They had something you enjoyed about them, and they felt more real. They felt more like a person than they felt like just a one-dimensional character that just believes in one thing, and that once you scratch it all away, there's nothing there, like I said. 
And when you look at volumes 1 through 3, each character, or at least a lot of them, had decent development. Some characters had some very good development, and they felt like they were characters you could attach yourself to, that you could relate to. And that was a good thing, and it's not feeling like that as much as it used to. A lot of characters have really been dubbed down, and it really hurts their character because it makes them look worse. I mean, we've talked about Ruby before, and the thing is, her herself, and you know, I love the old Ruby, she was an enjoyable character to watch, and now she's so bland and she's so one-dimensional that her character doesn't even feel like she was who she was in the past at all. She doesn't even feel like the old Ruby, period. She just feels like a completely different character that's just there. And another thing that world building has really, you know, done that has hurt is it has taken away some other questions that need to be answered, like the Silver Eyes, for example, which has also been brought up. And that's the thing. This is something that needs to be focused on. And rather than later, it needs to be brought up sooner. And that's the thing. For this to be pushed back, because it obviously is important to the plot, but for this to continuously be pushed back, it is a bad thing to look at. Because then, of course, it leaves the question to still be answered, and it irritates the fans because this means that, yet again, when this question could have been answered, and considering it's been foreshadowed again, that it then irritates the fan base more because then they think, well, this is supposed to be important and you keep teasing us with this, it becomes a problem. Not only this, but there are even some conflicts between characters that still need to be answered. There are even some parts to characters' backstories that still need to be answered. And world building is sadly enough getting in the way at this point of answering these questions or even focusing on these parts that really need to be focused on. But anyways, let me know what you think down below. Do you agree? Do you disagree? Let me know in the comments down below. But anyways, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And if you did enjoy, hit the video with a like. Subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And share this with your friends if you found this informative or useful. Well, anyways, take care of yourselves. Have yourselves a wonderful day out there, everyone. And remember, if today was not a good day, tomorrow could always be better. Take care of yourselves and have yourselves a wonderful day, everybody. All right? Have a good one out there.